Are you looking for a surefire way to improve your message engagement? Well, look no further than segments. Our research has shown that messages that use segments see 83% higher rates of engagement. But I know it can be overwhelming to figure out which segments you should create and which data filters you should pick to target the right users. Well, good news. OneSignal has a really intuitive segment builder that makes it easy to create a totally custom segment in a matter of seconds. I'm Julia, a product marketer here at OneSignal, and today I'm gonna to walk you through some user segmentation best practices so you can start improving your message engagement. You can use segments to drive your goals. For instance, try targeting new users with onboarding information to improve activation, or target abandoned cart or free users with a value prop or promotion to drive revenue. Consider targeting inactive users with a value prop, new feature, or a promotion to boost retention. Here's a handy overview for how you can approach creating segments strategically. First, identify a key business or team objective. Then select the audiences and campaigns that drive that objective. Pick the data filters you need to create the necessary audience segments. And then of course, create the segment and send targeted messaging to those groups of users. Fortunately, OneSignal makes it super easy to create a segment. Simply go to your audience and then select New Segment. This will pull up the segment editor. And as you can see, there are lots of filters you can choose from to whittle down to a targeted audience. I also just want to flag that if you have data tags set up, you can use this custom information to create a targeted segment. For the sake of today's video, I'm going to walk through how you can create an onboarding segment. To target new users, select the first session filter and set it as first session less than one hour ago. You'll see zero users here just because I'm using a test app. In your app, you'll see a live estimate of how many users qualify for that segment. Then select create segment. Another common use case is to target inactive users with a re-engagement campaign. You can easily create an inactive user segment by selecting new segment, last session, greater than, let's say 72 hours. This could be much higher or much lower depending on how you define inactivity. Further, let's make sure their first session was also greater than 30 days ago because we want to make sure that we're not targeting users who are still new and learning the app with a re-engagement campaign. Of course, make sure to title your segment, and then select Create Segment. By using segments, you'll be sure to see message engagement rates improve. If you haven't already, identify a few strategic segments for your company, create them in one signal, and start sending targeted messages to these groups of users. If you'd like to learn more about segments, please visit OneSignals documentation.